Landing Club is an American peer-to-peer -peer lending company headquartered in San Francisco, California. They are the world's largest peer-to-peer -peer lending platform. Their mission is helping Americans meet their life goals. They enable borrowers to create unsecured personal loans between $1,000 and $40,000. Their main goals are, one, to deliver world-class experiences, meaning making borrowing and investing simpler. Two, reinvent credit and investing. They are a technology company built on the belief that innovative, creative solutions deliver more value and a better experience. Three, level the playing field. They have built a marketplace that keeps costs low and opportunity high. Four, do what is right to develop ethical and responsible ways to bring greater value and better opportunities to customers. The Lending Club dataset consists on a whopping 887,379 entries and 76 columns data frame. Each record represents a detailed breakdown of a loan, including variables like loan amount, issue date, loan type, and others. The goal of this data set is to train a model that would be able to better understand consumer behavior and be able to predict whether a customer will default on its loan. To figure out this issue, we will use the Scikit-Learn's toolbox to pre-process, model, and classify this problem. So what is Scikit-Learn? A wise man once described Scikit-Learn as the Swiss knife of machine learning in Python. The open source machine learning library provides a wide range of supervised and unsupervised learning algorithms within the Python ecosystem. It is important to note that SKLearn is not concerned with the loading, handling, manipulating, and data visualization. Instead, it is meant to work along other packages such as Pandas, NumPy, and Matplotlib. The library was initially built upon the SciPy, Scientific Python. Back then, any extensions or modules for SciPy were conventionally named Scikit, therefore earning the name Scikit. Some of its most popular features include classification, regression, clustering, dimensionality reduction, model selection, and pre-processing. The project was started in 2007 as a Google Summer of Code project by David Cournapeau.